You, you think this will uh, this new traveling to the moon will get as big as the Apollo missions? I hope so. You know, I worry about that because I'm a huge space enthusiast. It's not like you have to sell this idea to me to be interested in Artemis. I'm I'm sold. You know. But not everybody is interested in space travel. There's a lot of people that are on the other side of the, of the argument saying, why are we spending all this money on space when we have all these issues down here on Earth that we need to fix? But space travel is the future. We need to become an interplanetary species. Earth is not going to be around forever. And I, I'm not trying to say that we should leave Earth because we've already messed it up and we need to start messing up another planet. We still need to fix Earth, but we need to expand our horizons we need to colonize the moon and mars so that if something happens like what happened 65 million years ago to the dinosaurs we have a backup plan we can survive as a species so it's necessary and i and i don't see a lot of the general public feeling that yet you know i'm i'm involved in a lot of you know space related groups on facebook or tiktok or twitter or whatever and everybody in those groups is you know as gung-ho about this whole plan as i am but I think the general public is not as educated on all of it and doesn't really get it, and that worries me. I want the, I want the, the energy, the excitement that they felt during Apollo 11. I want that to sweep over the nation. And...